Hello and welcome to part 17 of Let's Play Pokemon White. And um, yeah, still in this cave, I'm afraid, but we will be getting out of it very shortly, so don't worry about that. <laughs> yeah, because we have now been in this cave for three parts. And it's N. Dun, dun, dun. Yeah, it's N at the end. I mean, I don't know if they did that on purpose, but <laughs> they did. Yeah. So yeah, we have to battle him before we can get out of the cave, because okay. they're trying to prove, I don't know, something <laughs> about some sort of challenge for you. Or something like that, something stupid. Well, well let's kill him. We have Boldor. Yeah, we have Boldor again. Because, I mean, like, I think you mentioned before in the very early part, he always just has whatever Pokemon's about. Yeah. The wild Pokemon, so. Obviously, because this is about. We're gonna kill I him. I think the last couple he does have a proper squad, and when you last fight him, he'll have, like, this fully evolved thing. Wow. It's either that or he just has odd Pokemon from all the teams he's had, I'm not sure. Well, I, I, we'll have to see. I mean, that's quite a while off, I would think. I mean, I don't know, but... Oh, well, not, nothing too hard. These Pokemon are pretty simple. I mean, he's not very hard. <laughs> no. So yeah, we actually only ever saw one Ferro Seed in this whole cave. Like, I saw it at the very beginning, I think, and that was it. Didn't see it at all. Even off screen, when I was wandering about, I didn't see it at all. I think it's quite a rare Pokemon. Did you catch it? When you saw no, it? I just I can't remember. I don't, I'm sure. I know I didn't catch it, but I don't think I even tried. I think it's like the second rarest Pokemon in this cave. Okay. Well, what's the first? The drill it is. is. Yeah, the full evolution of Drill Ball, which only ever appears in those rough spots. Well, wow, there we go. That's pretty rare. So yeah, not much to talk about because these are just the same Pokemon that we've killed many times in this cave. I guess it's a nice summary Clink. for all the Pokemon here. Did you say, is Clink in your squad? Clink is in or my squad, Clink. yes. Coggers, is Coggers he's called Coggers, so he you. will be addressed as such. <laughs> I don't call my Pokemon by their actual names. I don't know their actual names. <laughs> and now they come. <laughs> yeah, now they show up because they're weak. She's a professor and <laughs> Bianca's already been robbed once this game. Let's not let it happen again. <laughs> Yeah, he thinks you're pretty cool though. So he goes on about rubbish like that. Like, like, yeah, like yeah. all the time. Stuff that we don't care about. Oh, well. He can think what he wants. But this is a Pokemon game, so overall it's going to be about being nice to everyone. Yeah, AKA I, Pokemon. And I just realised, like, with the speech bubbles, there's arrows pointing, pointing to the trainer, trainers. Have they always been in the Pokemon games? But I've just never noticed it. Well, I, I haven't noticed it, but, um, not in the originals, that's for sure, um, not in second generation, I'm gonna guess not in the third generation. No, I don't think so. Probably either. in the fourth, though. I would say it's gonna be, in, it would have been in the fourth generation. Hmm. And yeah, Repel wore off just in time, and luckily there is a Pokemon Center, like, right there, yeah. like, right there, which is, they obviously knew people were gonna have a bad time in that cave. And this is a real weird city, it's literally just loads of houses dotted just over this big area. Yeah, it's an airport city. Yeah, so it's no this one. massive airport. That's what a lot of airport cities are like, I think. I mean, I don't know. So yeah, these are a load of people that you can come and see. They don't really do anything that interesting, but if you need a move deleted, <laughs> come to this guy. And there's two beds for four people. Um, the old man sleeps in the shed outside. That's I, I think that move in the rain. is the earliest one in all the Pokemon games because I know it's usually around the eighth gym. Well, we have no. Nah, is it when the originals? It wasn't that late, was it? I think it was like seventh gym. Well, what, where? Because the eighth was, was in the uh, the actual first city you went to, so it wasn't there. So it must have been around the seven. Ah, oh, I don't know. I mean, I, I never. They're not that late. I, I don't think in the second generation it's that late. This eighth gym city. Oh. Oh, but there are sixteen gyms. So. Yeah, so I, I mean, I guess. But it's still earliest. I think it's earliest. Yeah, I, I don't know. I don't look out for move deleters really, so it's I can only say. Only useful if you want to get rid of a HM one of the Pokemon. So yes, yeah, she's the gym leader. Just so you know, just mm -hmm. flagging that up. And she's a pilot. Yeah, she's Skylar. So, um, quick question: What sort of type of Pokemon is she? Because I haven't faced her uh, as of I yet. I would, I would, I was guessing flying because she can fly a plane. But then there was these hints that suggested that she was not flying. I think it's steel. I can't remember. It was a while ago when I did. Steel. This. 
But I think you have to do quite a lot before you actually face her. Still, well that makes sense. I think. Duh, obviously it's steel. <laughs> you can know, I mean I guess planes are made out of steel, I guess I'll... Yeah. That's the weak connection, but... Yeah. So yeah, she wants you to go to the tower, which is definitely not a rip-off of here in the second generation, when you have to go heal the electric Pokemon on top of the lighthouse. Yeah. This is completely different. Yeah. And whoever says so is... Yeah. And it's literally just like, yeah, it's like that lighthouse mixed with the Pokemon tower. Uh, yeah, it's the Pokemon Tower, but it's a lighthouse. I, 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 it doesn't even make any sense that there's graves in a lighthouse. I don't think there's any lighthouses in the world where there's graves in them. <laughs> Definitely not Pokemon graves, because, you know, Pokemon don't exist. Dun, dun, dun. Yeah, I don't know if anyone knows that, but Pokemon aren't actually real in Japan. <laughs> if you go to Japan, you don't have, like, you're not going to get mugged by Pikachu. You're, the only you're thing okay. real about Pokemon are the region. Yeah, um, are they? Yes, yeah. the regions are named after places in Japan. Oh, all right. <laughs> well. Handy fact there. Oh, well, there we is go. Is that meant to be like a little farm or something? Um, like yeah. Or? Apparently, you can grow vegetables, harvest moon styley, but that's gay. I'm not doing that. <laughs> it's just stupid. I, I thought it would be very. No, he says vegetables. Because oh. I just spoke to that guy. Does, does he do it or do you do it? You do it, but I, I'm guessing you can get seeds from somewhere. I'm guessing you might sell them and make money or something. Oh yeah, oh. or they. That's healing stuff. I really don't know. Vegetables are, are good for you. Are there berries in this game? I can't remember. Are there uh, like yes, there are berries. I'm not sure about berry pack. I, I'm not too sure. Is I, it like because if we get berries off the rangers, if you remember. Oh yeah, because I know in the part going to the server you get pots and you plant them there. I don't know whether you get anything like that in this. Uh, uh, maybe. I really don't. Berries aren't that useful. Why would you can get potions and stuff? And you can get citrus berries, which are quite useful. Well, berries are good. It's just there's in the old games there was it was a lot of effort to do it, so I never did it. I, I'm using. I'm going to start using berries on my emerald. Actually, I planted loads because if you, especially healing ones on all Pokemon games, healing ones are actually really useful. Yeah, it's like, well, it's I mean, still like 30 well. HP, which is pretty good. And, uh, and yeah, we haven't faced old emo kid for a while, emo nerd guy, because we faced <laughs> the anchor at the, like after we got the badge, I think. Yeah, and we saw. And um, just a little spoiler: we won't be facing him while we're heading to the Pokemon Tower, and we won't face him yeah. up on the, along this route. Maybe after the Pokemon Tower, but uh, I mean, I don't know. It's quite weird. The last time we saw him was before play. Did yeah. You? That's when he pretended to help us out to catch Team Plasma. Well, he literally just watched you fight them. Which was good of him. Yeah. And this is one of the ones where I was like, I have no idea what that name is. I have no idea what he's going to send out. So I stuck with him with Mark Strong when really I didn't have the change out at all. Yeah, this is, as you can probably tell, it's the evolution of that monkey. Yeah, or Pan Sage. Sage. But all they did is change, it's the same with all the, the other two monkeys, they just changed the Pan to Silly. Yeah, then you can find them. Okay. I think we see all of them in this part actually. I'm not 100% sure, but I have seen them all at this point. Yeah, so, so far, we've seen Simi set each. Yeah. And also, oh, this I don't like this grass. I Do just you have the Yes, but I, I just couldn't be bothered to use them. I didn't think it would be a problem. I didn't want to stop, pause, and you know. And did you train Pink? Because he's caught up. He has experience, yeah. Oh, that's, that's if, you, if you've been paying attention, <laughs> you would see that every time I kill a Pokemon, it says Cogger's gained so much experience. Oh. So yeah, then I thought, yeah, Cogger's go, yeah, use your R, oh, it doesn't affect it. <laughs> Retreat, said something else, that's decent. But at least you get, um, if you've given, if you don't want to have another Pokemon gaining experience, just the Pokemon you're using, give it the XP share, and I think it gets double what it would normally get. Uh, I think it's I near the, double, I I'm not sure if it's... One exactly double but I don't know it's hard to say. There's that, the full evolution of that. Yeah energy. we haven't seen this one before. It looks pretty terrifying how yeah, that is massive. See most Pokemon in this game will go three times. I think I've already said that. Oh uh, yeah. Well that was always the case. Well not always the case but most of the time. And the older ones. It was about 50-50 in the older ones I guess. In the older generations. And this is quite early in the game to have one that was third evolution. But, so it's mm. quite, if you have one it's quite good to have. Well, it's quite early to see one, or see an AI have one that isn't a gym leader. Yeah. That's pretty rare. Because they, if there's three evolutions, they rarely have the last one. 
I remember the Levelling was in the third gym. Oh, uh, yeah. Like, how many gym have you? Five? Five, yeah, so yeah five at this point. Sixth one, yeah, this would be the sixth. Okay. I'm sure it's five, anyway. Okay, three more to go. We did the first one, the, well, did the grass one for me, normal, and then, oh, yeah, it's. And then electric. Uh, electric. Then play. Yep, so far. Yep, so only three more to go. Yeah, good one. <laughs> With <laughs> the old maths there. <laughs> Shut up. So yeah, I told you we saw this is Sin sincere. Sin they get it? Sincere. Yeah. Uh, uh, they all have very strange hair. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> the other one had like a weird apple thing. That was a spike. Yeah, I don't know what's going on there. <laughs> yeah, I, I gave this a rage bulk up because I don't. I never use those sort of moves, but I, I don't know for some reason bulk up seemed good. Like I will be using it at some point. It is, like, because... It's better uh, than Leer, anyway. Leer's good, but I'd have bulk up, because that does two, that boosts two instead yeah. of one. I never used to be a fond of raising, like, your own attack or special attack or whatever, but I've actually got used to it, and it can actually help quite a lot. Yeah, it does. That's, that's tactic, that is. It's just when, you know... I guess when I was younger, I was like, Yeah! You <laughs> scratch! Yeah! Oh, I died! But now I know what to do. This more. place is important very later on. It's not in the storyline, it's just something for like a... You, I suppose you could say side quest, but right. if you do that one, you come back here. Okay, well there we go. That's, that's good to know, that's knowledge. <laughs> yeah, this is quite a big route as well. This is pretty much as big as Route 6. Is it meant for like a swamp type of place? No, it's just raining. That's and I believe is. this is the first triple battle. Yeah, I was going to say that. We cut me in. <laughs> so yeah, it's a f super random. It's like, oh by the way, here's a triple battle. And I was like, what? I, I got a bit thrown by it, so I didn't. I thought it would actually be a your first triple battle would be a big event, but no, it's just some random guy who just says, let's take on three. Yeah, this three. You gonna explain or can I? No, you you explain. Uh, right. This is quite confusing because depending on where the places are on your Pokemon, depends on what Pokemon you can attack. That's the good. middle one can attack all three. Um, the one on the left can attack the one on the left in the middle and the one on the right can attack the one on the right in the middle and you can uh, you can switch round as like it takes up a turn but you can switch with another person with another one of your Pokemon you, you took a long that's it's not that confusing it's just the one in the middle can attack all of them one on the left left two one on the right right two that's how I would have explained it but yeah as you can see I'm getting you know they are killing me out here that's because they're bullies they bully my Pokemon like as you can see, Kogas hasn't been hit once, and he's been out the whole time. And they just attack the stronger ones with better attacks. <laughs> but I still managed to win. But I, God, three Pokémon die in the process. Yeah, this is good by training because obviously all three Pokémon gain experience. Yeah, yeah. Level up quite so yeah, that's that. That's our first trip. I was actually going to keep that at normal speed, but it took quite. It was quite a long battle. I think it didn't seem it, it was black. That'll be a rotation battle. Because wow. obviously there's more rotation battles in black and there's more triple battles in white. Well, triple battles are cooler. I don't know what rotation battle is, but if it's not in this game, I can't be honest. And here's some random phone call from your mum. And we thought we'd never see her again. Uh, <laughs> I yeah. think that's the button. I think it looked like I skipped it, that, but that was just me reading it and pressing A as quick as I could. Well, not as quick as I could, but that was just me reading it normally. I didn't actually. None of that was fast forward. I don't know how you meant to have a Pokemon battle on that thing. Uh, well, they're both flying types, yeah, so, so they can yeah, just fly. Just fly but Professor Rage, can, he's a strong lad. He can hang on like <laughs> Donkey Kong or something and just punch him from underneath. They should make like a Pokemon like. Donkeymon or something. Donkeymon? What are you talking about? <laughs> like Donkey Kong, Donkeymon. I don't... Yeah, but what <laughs> would that game be? I don't know, uh... Pokio. <laughs> what? No! I, I wasn't asking... I was asking what it would be. It would be a Pokemon Mario game. Oh, forget yeah, it. You have to jump about and squish Gumbas and then fight train. <laughs> well, it could be squishing, um... Ratatas. That would work. <laughs> yeah, that. That would actually be well fun, yeah, but I want that. <laughs> yeah, I've done stuff like that, just not as a Mario platformer, like yeah. the Pokemon Rumble, I think it was called. It's just stuff like that. Yeah. I mean, I know there's a... I don't know if it's a hack, but it's like this game, online game, where you're... It's a Mario game, but you can play as all different characters, like Link, Mega Man, stuff like that. Well, that that's pretty cool. Right, it's coming to the end of the part, so we'll see you next time. Goodbye. Bye.